Michaela here, we're just bringing the boys in, but welcome to the new YouTube video where we're going to be showing you the um, ponies. So they'll be Blaze, Leah and Dora. So this is my first pony, Blaze. Um, he is a Welsh Section C Cross New Forest, so literally like the cheekiest pony you can ever get. He's 14 years old, so you're not that young, are you? Although he still acts like a four year old. <laughs> And yeah, he was literally the best first pony. He taught me so much. I used to get decked at least three times a week with him. But you know what? He taught me to be the rider I am today. So I'm very grateful for that. There were so many times where I just wanted to give up with him. But my mum told me to stick with it. So we did. And then here we are. We still got him. <laughs> In the past, he, co he competed up to probably 95. But I never really pushed him that much because I was getting my confidence and I was only young. Um, and we were just learning together, to be honest, because obviously he was my first pony. He's got good ground manners. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Does he really? <laughs> Although he can tend to run off. <laughs> so when we bring him in from the field, sometimes he likes to go have a nibble. Um, of in the garden, in he makes garden. a beeline for the garden and then just so runs off. He doesn't like fly spray. If you try to um, spray fly spray on him, he'll try and kick you. Uh, neither does he like baths. You try and make him clean, he will rear up. We'll just do do everything to avoid it, won't you? But he's very smart, so he knows loads of tricks. We will never sell him because, like, he doesn't owe us anything. So yeah, that is Blaze. I'm surprised he hasn't run off magic. That's a bonus. Good boy, Blaze. You're not running off. Okay. So shiny. Broken along. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town I'm searching for the lost and found But you don't care, you're unaware Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air, like a blazing flare Just there, cause the flames will burn us back So this is Leah, Leah, <laughs> Leah, <laughs> Lily, Leah <Lily. laughs> You're trapped you may think she doesn't want to be here, but she actually does love me. So this is Leah. She's a 14-1 Connemara Cross, 11-year-old mare that loves me so much, don't you? <laughs> she just has a permanent face like this, and her ears pin back to her head. She was my first ever pony. We bought her when I was nine or ten. I can't actually remember. Um, and we thought she was six, but someone wrote over her passport and she was actually four. So, great. <laughs> we bought her because, honestly, her grand manners are impeccable and um, I got on her and took her around the woods when we went to view her when I was a nine-year-old and she was just a saint. <laughs> she is actually the best first pony anyone could ask for. She has gone from popping over cross poles and not even being able to canter on the right lead to jumping 90 centimetres BS. Excuse me, can you drive a bit slower? <laughs> And she has got an awesome back end. Unfortunately, she um, had a field accident um, a couple of years back where she tore her annual ligaments, had to have, had, had to have surgery. She's now healed fully and she just loves life. Like, she's just chilling, really. We will keep her forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever. single video we have is there's a <laughs> Tigger comes in it so here's Tiggy coming I say hello hello Tiggy Wiggy meow, meow. <laughs> it would not be a YouTube video from us if it did not feature Tigger so this is my very special pony Dora um, we've had her since June because she was my present for finishing my exams okay you do not want to be in the video <laughs> <laughs> so she's by a stallion called primavera b who has volatare and darko limes 
and she's out of a mare called Pompadour. She's a full up 148, um, although when she was born, she was actually born a twin. So her, no, please can you cooperate? Thank you. Her brother was actually 17 too. Um, so basically she got squished in the womb. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the way she's standing. She's a full out 148 nine year old AES mare. So Anglo-European sport horse. Um, I only had her for a little bit because obviously I'm 17 next week. So I was off the ponies. <laughs> I only had her from July to December last year. But my mum basically bought her for me to jump the bigger heights on and get more experience because she was quite experienced at those heights. So she basically just gave me all the confidence to jump the bigger tracks. She's just the most genuine mare because she, her grand manners are just like impeccable. impeccable yeah. Oh, literally. snap. Um, and she's not marriage at all. She's literally good to do in every single way. Never puts up a fuss about anything. Um, I'd say the only thing that was it's not even bad about her it's just her like her personality but when she goes in the ring for prize giving she just likes to hop about on the spot a bit <laughs> she just gets a bit mad if she doesn't go up come first and sadly my little baby is going to be for sale after lockdown but we're in no rush to sell her so we might get her out jumping on a ticket in bs just to keep her ticking over and we'll do some pony club activities uh, the most annoying thing is that we actually qualify for the royal windsor horse show so obviously with COVID-19 and everything that was cancelled, she can come on, please. Five more minutes is all I ask of your cooperation, please. Yeah? Thank you. So with me, Dora competed up to um, the JC, so 115, 120. Obviously we would have gone higher, but due to lack of time, she just taught me the ropes of doing those classes. Um, but she has all the potential in the world. She's definitely a voice contender with the right rider. I can't focus. I can't forget. I've been thinking too much lately. I just need to clear my head. I just need to clear my head. I just need to clear my head. Me again. <laughs> Uh, thanks for watching the video. Um, please, if you could like and subscribe and help us get to 3k, that would be amazing. See you next time. <laughs> if you stay tuned, then you're going to see a sneak peek of what's coming up in next week's video.